Hi, my name is Manish Dugo. Just bought this place in August. It's about 12 years old. Uh -huh. it's been, one's been empty since 2002, one's been empty since 2004. Working with partnership with the council. Yeah. With the empty home scheme that they got in place to get it back up to scratch and back on the market. Tell, tell us what it's like. It looks a bit of a state. It is quite bad, like. <laughs> I do want to admit, if you can see outside in the front. Right. It's quite appalling. I'll, I'll swing that round so people can have a look. What, what are you having to deal with then? This place, what, hasn't been occupied for about 10 years? Yeah, that's right. No electrics, no water supply, no gas. The electric wires upstairs all shot off. There's uh -huh. been pigeons living in the loft, which I've had to get rid of. Yeah. So that sounds like a lot of work, but you're not going to have to do it all by yourself, yeah? No, Just... I will be using contractors as a subcontractor on a lot of the work out as well. And what help has the council given you? Yeah, they give, they give, they they provide a grant of twenty thousand pounds to get both properties back up. Yeah. To scratch. Today, the new owners of this property are starting to get quotes and looking at what they're going to do with this property to renovate it. It's a long term empty, it's been empty for 13 years and we've been involved in it the last couple of years with the previous owner who promised lots of times that he was going to do the works, he was going to apply for grants yeah. and it never materialised. So what we actually did was we served an empty dwelling management order on the property where we would take over the management of the property. Um, and during that process, he decided that he wanted to sell uh -huh. and he sold it to the, these new owners that are here today. And they've applied for an empty homes grant and we've worked with them before and we're confident that they're going to renovate this property and bring it back into use. So that's going to be good for them. It's good for everyone who lives here too, isn't it? Tim? Oh, definitely. I mean, the, the owners next to so as you can see from the state of it, um, you know, it's not a nice place to live when you've got a, a eyesore like this next door and worry about damp. Um, vandalism, that type of thing. So again, they'll be very pleased that this is uh, getting back into use.